We're shaking. Good to see you. I know it's been a minute. Where have I been? None of your business. Point is, I'm back. This is another episode of Cab Cabernet's Dine of the Day. I am Cab Cabernet, a.k.a. Chef Cabernet. And um, it is a pleasure for you to be here because um, tonight we're going to do something very interesting that I've never done before. And, you know, I'm a chef. I cook all the time. But I've never cooked this particular meal. So you're in for a treat. What do we have here? We have uh, some chicken breast cutlets. We have uh, some petite sweet potatoes. Got some veggies for salad and some nice uh, baguette. So what we're gonna do is a simple grilled chicken salad, uh, grilled chicken garden salad uh, with some petite sweet potato fries, but we're gonna we're gonna do a twist with this, okay? We're going to um, we're gonna cook this in THC oil. That's right, THC oil. Compliments of our sponsor, Buka Butts. Okay, uh, a product of Buka Rants Enterprises. Uh, this is olive oil infused with THC and CBD. That would be used for the chicken. For the uh, sweet potato fries, being that they're sweet potatoes, we're going to go with the coconut, the virgin unrefined coconut oil because it's sweet. But it's also infused with the THC and CBD. So we're going to fry these sweet potato fries in the coconut. The result of this should be euphoric. Some might say groovy. Let me prep. we be back five minutes. Stay tuned. Mr. Cabernet, Mr. Cab Cabernet, Mr. Cabernet, Mr. Cab Cabernet. I want to invite you So, we got our veggies prepped, as you can see, right? So we're gonna, we're gonna do the fries first because the fries are gonna take a little bit longer than the chicken. So we're gonna, we're gonna start the fries first, all right? <clears throat> Sweet potato fries, not tough to make, but tougher to cut than regular potatoes. So you really gotta have a nice knife. I uh, definitely suggest the trusted butcher chef's knife or you know anything similar something that's razor sharp and uh you know it can do the job well i'm cutting these fries right this is the olive oil for the chicken we're gonna start with that in terms of the oil itself yeah you see it's a little darker these are made with the actual leaves um, of course, filtered out. This is the coconut. We're gonna need a little more of this because we're gonna cover these fries as well as possible. You know, not a deep fry, but I want to make sure that you know they're covered. That should do it. Is there? It's a little to take you in to the zone. I prefer, you know, like a mid-sized potato. Not not too thin like Mickey D's, but also not too thick like potato wedges. You know what I mean? I don't think that's attractive. So we got uh we got some fries here. We're going they're going in. Going in, going in, right? Get the chicken, just throw it in there. This is a simple grilled chicken salad. 
The only thing that's sophisticated and a little different is, is, the, is the oil we're using. But you can use traditional spices. You know, um, we're going to go with an all-purpose spice like this. You know, Badia, complete seasoning. This has salt, pepper, garlic, onion powder, like oregano, uh, 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 parsley, and all that kind of stuff. Some more Italian seasonings so we can get some of that uh, thyme and uh, rosemary. And we'll throw a little spice on it, some red hot pepper flakes. Why not? Some like it hot. You dig what I'm saying? Put some garlic in there, some fresh garlic, why not? I like to put my garlic on after when it comes to uh, certain dishes, you know. Um, I know you're probably used to seeing people throwing the garlic and onion in first. And that's cool for some dishes, but garlic burns fast. So when you're grilling, um, and you, you don't want that burnt garlic, it might be beneficial to put it in after or, or you know, when it's time to turn the chicken rather than in the beginning. The, the onion will stand up longer than the garlic. So, I throw the garlic in now. We're going on with some fries. Good. Little garlic. We got the fries rocking. We're going to do the rest of these potatoes and fries. Right? We're going to be back in like 20 minutes. Stay tuned. Now, as you can see, these fries are halfway done, looking beautiful. Let's start turning them a little bit. You can smell this aroma, man. You can, you can smell this coconut oil. It's a strange smell because it got that, uh, they got that THC and that uh, CBD in it, you know, so you can tell it's something a little different, but it got that rocking. Turn these chickens. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Again, simple garden salad and lettuce. Spring mix is already here. Let me grab a bowl real quick. Mix as well as you so you get yourself. This is Clean the Queen. This is a new brand that I like. Already washed uh, spring mix ready to eat. We got some cucumbers. Same thing with the tomatoes. Flip them over and go to work. One, two, three. That's it. You know, you cut them how you want. That's how I like to cut them. And I like a little red onion in my joint as well. Red onion gives it a bite. You know? I like a bite in my salad. This. Do this. Throw that right on top of there. Red onion is not for the faint of heart. It's not for everyone. You gotta know what you're doing. But it's beautiful, look at it. So the salad's done, that's a licking split. See what I'm saying, one, two, three. Let's check on these fries. Looking good, looking great. Yeah, and um, I'm not exactly sure how much THC is in, is in this oil. This is sourced locally from our farmer in Western Massachusetts and um, all I know is that the buzz is for real. Because I had some, I baked some cookies with this a few months back. 
and to sneak up on you, no doubt. You know, this is this is good for cats that want to get that buzz but don't want to smoke. Yeah, I might just start a trend, you know what I'm saying? Fried chicken, imagine frying some chicken with some TAC oil. Kill him. I'm not such a, I'm not, I'm not such a boy. Yeah. So we almost done here. Five minutes, we're gonna play. Stay tuned. Alright, so here we go. Let's take these uh these fries out. Looking lovely. And again, I didn't season these. Because I again I've never done this dish and I want to taste the uh coconut, the coconut flavor. The sweetness of the coconut against the sweetness of the sweet potato, the natural sweetness, instead of flavor and everything. I just want to know what, you know, is this too sweet? Is it, you know. Um, but these are ready. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'll turn this off. Let those drain out, as you can see. Let's just dice these a little bit. Yeah. I'm just gonna slide it, slide it right on top of the salad, just like so. Real simple, real simple. That'll do, right? Beautiful. Little uh, olive oil from Greece, yeah. And this dish, let's do some apple cider vinegar with the mother. Never use apple cider vinegar without the mother. Never without the mother. Okay. Then, take a nice little bushel of fries right here. Throw them on the side. Right on the side. Yes, baby. Now, you could do croutons. But... This baguette looked so beautiful. Look at this baguette, it's beautiful. So, instead, I'll just tear a piece of baguette off of here. A couple slices. All right. All right there. Voila, the sweet potato fries cooked in coconut THC CBD oil, grilled chicken uh, salad cooked in the uh, olive oil CBD uh, THC oil, and uh, the baguette. And of course, we'll wash it down. The wine of choice today, we're doing a Greek wine, okay? We're doing a Greek. So we're gonna do a, a the Omicron Retsina, okay? This has like a piney uh, taste to it. We're gonna, we're gonna play the uh, coconut off the pine. You think what I'm saying? Once again, this is Mr. Cab Cabernet, Chef Cabernet to you. And this has been another episode of Cab Cabernet's Dine of the Day. And uh, if you don't know by now, Crush grapes is a lifestyle. Bon appetit. Cheers. Mr. Cabernet, Mr. Cab Cabernet, Mr. Cab Cabernet, Mr. Cab Cabernet, Mr. Cab Cabernet.